Like, I just tell people I play Dungeons & Dragons with my buddies because anything more than that, and you just... So, there was a version of Dungeons & Dragons that was owned by the company Wizard, but then they stopped using that version, and they sold it to another company, they call it Pathfinder. You know, it's one of those things where it's like, yeah, 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 okay, and do you know what pussy tastes like? Parents strongly caution, the following programs are intended for mature audiences over the age of 18. These programs may contain some material that many parents would not find suitable for children and may include intense violence, sexual situations, coarse language, and suggestive dialogue. Not gonna lie, I don't remember where we left off. We were doing something. Ah, return the Demogai's moons to Gladwin. Okay, what the fu- uh oh. Ah! Am I not supposed to be seen? Am I not supposed to be here? What the fuck? They're very bad at their jobs. I just booked it. Not really. Oh, it's nighttime. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? We just started. I feel like as an American, if I if I went to Hogwarts as like a um, a transfer student, I would have just owned the goddamn thing. <laughs> it's just been like, nah. Nah, I'm gonna go though, dork. Get out of my way. Pop. <laughs> Like, remember Muggle fighting? Remember how they mentioned that when Harry beat the shit out of Draco with, I think it was Fred or George, one of the twins. How do I crouch? How do I crouch? How do I crouch? How do I crouch? That's not crouching. I don't remember. Ooh, a page. Uh... Oh, that's right. You don't crouch. You, uh... You're invisible yourself. Ah. Uh... Bitch. <sighs> okay, well, I... Just straight up don't remember what we were doing. Do we have to catch that page again? No, probably not. No. Good. What we gotta do is this. First of all, we gotta remember how to there play the we game. Go. Yeah, there we go. Handboy asks if we're muted. Uh, Did we not put the right? No, we're not muted. At least we shouldn't be. I have no idea. Twitch. Kind of sucks ass. Microphone on, audio, game. I mean, the quality looks like fucking ass. That's that's usually Twitch. Still, though, I don't know what the fuck's going on. You got right. the right mic. Plug it in. Yeah, of course I do. All it's right. the only other mic on there. There's two mics. mic plugs. There's one for my headphones when I'm actually gaming online, and then there's this one that... It's okay. not, even the audio from the game isn't coming out. That is super queer. I don't know, man. I don't think there's good connection going on. I think we might have to abandon Twitch on this one. Son of a... You know what? I'll restart it and we'll see what's up. What? Okay, what's going on? What is happening, dude? Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and restart the console. I don't even know... What the fuck that was. But, uh, this is a great start to everything. I'm about to just unplug the goddamn console if it takes forever. I mean, I'm unplugging the console. It's gonna be like that, say, huh? Clear the cache, because that needs to be a thing, apparently. Never was a thing on any of the other consoles, but now it's a thing, because computers have a cache that needs to be cleared. So the Xbox needs to be like computers, because computers and Xbox and... Everything needs to be the same. That was hella annoying. Oh, good. Quick resume. That's going to make everything better. How about... Here's an idea. We quit the fucking game because whatever executive at Microsoft who thinks quick resume is a good idea needs to shove it so far up at their fucking ass it comes out of their goddamn mouth. Shut the fuck up and let us, you know, fucking play our video games the normal way. Because if you leave a game on quick resume... For too long, it just it falls apart. Remember when, what did we boot up that like was on quick resume? Oh yeah, it was Hellblade. It was like three days later or something like yeah, that. Yeah, fucking fragmented. Yeah. So you don't do that. You're not being helpful. You're then it being took a... like 20 minutes to start back up properly. <sighs> just constantly breaking your own shit for no reason. I swear to God, I am this close. Do I look at my... Finally, hello. Do I look at my... Fucking it. I am this fucking close. To just ending Twitch? Yeah, to just giving up on Twitch completely. It's fucking garbage. It never fucking works right. Alright, before we get... Can I get a little meal? 
How dare you ask for something that I... That you have a lot of. I have so much of this stuff. And now we have to get that page again, but whatever. Yeah. it's it, That's not the problem. The problem is getting the fuck out of here. Oh, or not. Looks like the page is still gotten. Good. That's... Alright. Right? Right, let's just go Maybe I'll just save when you picked it up. That's awesome. Yeah, Hamboy, we're so back. I don't know what the fuck all that was about, but nothing was working. The audio wasn't working. Everything was glitching. It was awful. So yeah, now we're uh, we're actually back and actually playing this fucking game. He did not see us. Fuck that dude. Well, it's more like a chameleon rather than a full invisibility. Oh, right, right, right. He, he can hear us, and he might see the wavy lines of us moving. Right. It's like in a video game where you see someone shimmer. See, that's the type of invisibility my character is going to get later in uh, the Pathfinder. It's not uh, true invisibility, but it's going to be similar to those that. Those don't know Pathfinder is a variant of Dungeons & Dragons that isn't owned by the parent company that owns Dungeons & Dragons. It's not That's owned by the, wizards. Like, I just tell people I play Dungeons & Dragons with my buddies because anything more than that, and you just... So there was a version of Dungeons & Dragons that was owned by the company Wizard, but then they stopped using that version, and they sold it to another company, and they call it Pathfinder. It's like, nobody gives a shit. You know, it's one of those things where it's like, yeah, 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 okay. And do you know what pussy tastes like? Hello, Mr. Moon. I have we play D and D. Oh goodness! D and D is cool. An excellent start. If we can you gotta ease more, people into the nerd world. I know I hate his voice. Also, I'm pretty sure that voice was in Fable, right? He was in Fable, right? Sounds familiar. Yeah. Determined with your help to discover the identity of my torment. Oh, that's right. This guy gives us the ability to continue with this game. I'll see what I can do, but I'm fairly busy. I can't promise anything. Uh, understood. Uh, but I hope you will find the time. Uh, what, you mean uh, New Game Plus? Do have something to offer huh? New Game Plus style continue? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Continue the actual story in general. Oh. There is no New Game Plus. Disillusionment when necessary. If we want 100% this, we just roam around looking for all the things, which we could do. I mean, that could be like a fun video where we spend like a few hours going through everything and then I just make a video condensing it down. Right, right. Um, Understood. I shall keep an eye out. Well, we don't have to do this to continue anything other than to get more versions of Hel Aloha Mora. I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve. Oh, uh, no. Weird sounding cats. Oh. Yes, Miss McGonagall. We we will pet you behind the ears. You no, like but that? What was that meow? Not the proper meow of a cat. Ah. That's that's like someone who's never heard a cat meow. That reminds me of cats from Renaissance paintings. You know? <laughs> Which is like, have you seen a cat? It's that moment. People who mimic cat meows, it's not meow. It's meow. Yeah. There is no M in meow. Meow. It starts with an R. Meow. <laughs> a meow starts with an R. Meow. Ma, 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 oh, you got points. Sweet. We got two points. Let's see what we got. Accio. No, oh, that would be fun. Uh. Nice. Fuck it. Uh, let's see where we're going. <laughs> Serona, a contentious character in this game, uh, said that the goblin I'm looking for is named Lodgog. Lodgok. He's known to frequent Hogshead Inn. 
Sorota personally vouched for him and told me to tell Lad Gog that she sent me. All right. It, she's a contentious character because she used to be a he and then given J.K. Rowling's previous statements and whatnot. Well, oh, to that say, character. Yeah. That everyone has a problem with because... But, like, honestly, is a pretty fine, well-written character. Like, I don't think there's really anything wrong with them at all. Uh, which one was this one? No. Was it Accio? Was it Incendio? Which one was it? I can't remember which spell it was. Uh, was it Levioso? Mm. That's, I think it was Levioso. <laughs> yeah. There it is. Oh, by the way. High places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Oh, are they around? I was gonna say to people watching, I'm not gonna do too much editing. Oh, there they are. Oh, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. Cause you know it's all about, about chilling with us. And honestly, the past two videos I've done that got a lot of views, one had quite a bit of editing, one had like none at all almost. So I'm, I'm thinking. I'm putting too much effort into this. <laughs> uh, it was hey, I got a lot of nice comments on one of my videos that just uh, made me feel a lot better. I've been dealing with a lot of imposter syndrome lately. Imposter syndrome. You know what that is, right? Yeah. It's basically not feeling that you are deserving of what you have achieved, i.e. a monetized YouTube channel where people are like... <laughs> It's like, am I, you know, am I still entertaining as just an individual? <laughs> Wait, I got it. Where's the Revelio? Oh, that's right. There we go. Uh, I've done. Oh, Portrait of Sir Cadagan. Oh, there he oh, is. Oh, that guy. Oh, <laughs> my God. There he is. Sir Cadagan himself. I feel honored to be in his presence. Look at him. I say we erase his mustache. Uh, wouldn't that be hilarious if you could? <laughs> no, young, young sir, my mustache. You knave. Ooh. There's chests in the area somewhere. Ah. Uh, I swore something moved when you walked into the room on the... Oh, it was another globe. What's that? Oh, it's a lamp. I thought it was like a thing I could touch because it kind of looked like there was like a... See how the dot appears above the globe? Yeah, there's one... That's on what the, I thought that was. There was one on the left side right there next to you. Yeah. When you came into I thought it was a thing. That Make you them globes with. spin. I love touching globes with my wand, if you know what I mean. I don't even know what I mean. I would have killed for this game as a kid. Alanon, more like it. You drunk. Actually, wait. Alanon's for people who are family members of drunks and narcotic users. My mom used to go to that. It always smelled like coffee and cigarettes. Hey, Tom Holland. Yeah, <laughs> it is. It's totally Tom Holland. That is a hundred percent. Somebody needs to show this to Tom Holland. He'd be like, I don't remember giving my likeness, but. I like Tom, that. you're playing the loot. Honestly, he work. He would have worked in in a Harry Potter thing. You know, he would have been. It would have been a fine addition to that group. Too bad. I don't even think he existed at that point. <laughs> He's so young. By the way, this song is a fucking vibe. He could have played a, a student. Yeah. Yeah, he could have been like a first year when they were seventh years or something like that. He could have been. Like a, he was he old enough. Been a younger year. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like he was old enough at the time. Seems like a nice kid. I hope nothing bad happens with him. You know, I hope it doesn't come out that like some terrible. Yeah, thing like that would really him. kind of just. It's like like Tobey Maguire is probably the edgiest Spider-Man we've had, and that's only because the paparazzi wouldn't get the fuck up out of his grill and let him live his life. And I feel that a hundred percent. Yeah. He seems like good people. Like if I ever met him, I wouldn't want to 
autograph or a picture, I'd just be like, thanks for being Spider-Man, dude. Thanks for being you. Like, I'd just be, I'd just be sweet to him, man. You know, like, I, I feel like someone like him needs that. The world needs that. Just, cause if I can say anything, people, the world needs you to be your best self right now, more than ever. It just needs you to be good. Whatever, whatever you can do to make people feel better. Because, goddamn, people are so fucking evil right now. It's, it's killing me, honestly. Like, it's one thing to, like, you know, have a bit of an edgy demeanor. It's another thing to just want to, like, make people feel bad. And you see that in, like, politics. You see it in social media. That's why in Fallout 76, I have the whole thing about, like, you know, hey, welcome to Fallout 76. Don't, Don't be, be a, a dick. dick. Be your best self or take your ass back to fall uh to, to Fortnite, you know? Like we we don't we don't need that there. Like all that Call of Duty, Fortnite, Roblox, edgy take that, psycho take energy. That shit back to that game. Yeah, that take it from. back to the games you came from. Okay, the I hate these little dots on mini maps because they never know where they're wanting you to fucking go oh yeah it's like using gps uh routing in a car no that actually works better than most video games now though i noticed my mom has a hard time with those yeah ham recalculate Hamboy's right be greater be greater than you think you can be you might surprise yourself that's the crazy thing um right b button but GPS has actually gotten really good. My mom has a hard time. I'm like, well, you should have played video games with me. You would understand GPS better. And she yeah. acts like that's a joke. And it's it's, it's not a joke. It's it actually helps we, you. Yeah. What is the speed up? But what is the normal? Oh, that's right. It's just right trigger. Left is the boost. This place has seen better days. No, it hasn't. It's. I mean. It, uh, I mean, it, to be fair, everything it's an is, old piece of castle, so yeah. Everything has seen better days around here, man. The problem with wizardry is that like they don't progress as a society. They make new spells and potions and magical items, but they don't like. Oh, that's right. And they still use quills. Y'all know pencils exist, right? If I went to Hogwarts, I'd be like, uh, teach. Y'all know pencils exist, right? What is a pencil? Behold, the number two yellow pencil. Watch. Behold, as I write things. Oh no, it broke. Behold, as I sharpen it with this magical tool called a sharpener. And now I shall write some more. I'm I'm pantomiming it out to D. That's why I stopped moving. I do that. See, that's that thing. In the, in their world, they don't understand they exist. But what did they go and do in the Goblet of Fire? Fucking crouch. Uh, understands they exist because he writes Harry's name with a pencil on lined paper <laughs> and puts it in the goblet. Not yeah, parchment I, with ink. <laughs> I just, you're right. Oh my god. Yeah. That's why that's, that's why, why in the movie, I, I, That's why Dumbledore should have been super sus on that one. Like, yeah. Mm. That's why in the movie Dumbledore's supposed to be all freaked out. It's like this is muggle paper with Pencil, not parchment and ink. That's why he got all stupid in the movie instead of being all sweet like he is in the book. And it's like, that's you dumb. Oh, look look what's going on over here. Ooh. Alright. Ah, no problem, man. Look, I would tip, except for I'm not going to tip that guy a damn cent. That's like using AI to make your music no, and art. Having, knowing a spell and using it, and then knowing a spell, mastering it, and utilizing it to make art are two completely different things. You know, it's one thing to know, like, for instance, I know how to draw a sword or a shield. But it's another thing to draw that sword and shield on a person in dynamic action with a big fucking world around them going on. Do you know what I mean? That's what this guy's doing. Like, no, this is an AI. What is with these commercials? This is just an episode of Transformers Earthspark. Just playing as a commercial on YouTube over there. Oh. Whoa, they all dipped out. Okay. That kid made a little change. I thought it was going to keep going. 
you know, oh, I'm, I'm always, daybreak. It's daybreak. It's now it's now morning. And I look at him. He's like, I uh, I'm always uh, two minds about things, <laughs> Batman. I do wish we could get a more accurate Two Face. Like I like Aaron Eckhart, but his Two Face was kind of there and then gone. Aaron Eckhart's a good actor, but yeah, his Two Face wasn't the greatest. And like, here's the thing: say what you want about Tommy Lee Jones and his Two Face. He had a look. He, he had, had a look. He had the him. look, and it worked. Honestly, oh yeah, Hamboy yeah, or two-hour political ads. Those are crazy too. That yeah, you'll get those, or like Manosphere ads, where it's like, yo, women are just like the worst too. Um. Eh, anyways, what was I just talking about? <laughs> what was I just talking about? Seriously. Oh, 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 oh. Tommy Lee Jones's Two Face feels like he could have fit in the Adam West show. Oh, yeah. Because Jim Carrey's Riddler was definitely the Riddler from the Adam West show brought to that modern day. I get that. But it feels like such departure from the Tim Burton stuff that I don't think those two movies should be included with the other two. Like, those four movies should be two separate units. Continuities, yeah. yeah. Actually, the the second two movies should also be... The, the final two movies should be also their own continuities because they're two separate Batman. Yeah, they're all... They're all continuity separations. Ugh. God, I'm so disappointed with all that right now. Yeah, I mean, it hurts so bad. We we had these conversations back. We're when always we gonna have. Them. You ever notice I repeat topics and things? That's because not everybody watches every one of our videos. So that you know, it's always good to repeat. It shit. always comes back to those Joel Schumacher films. So. It really does, man. Hmm. Nuts in my mouth. A little bit of me. Wait, is that head above him behind the bar moving? Yes, it is. It's the awesome. hog's head. Wait, are you Dumbledore's brother? No, wait, this is like a thousand years too early or something like that. At least a hundred years too early. Another beer. Bro. Are you just stealing people's beers? Magic beer? <gasps> Magic beer! Magic. So I had to spit that out. Wait, are the Durmstrang students here? That's their ads, remember? Not Durmstrang. What's the other one? Uh, the 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 French one with all the girls. Even oh. though that's not how it is in the book. Oh. Um, Beltoc. Oh, I can't remember uh. how it's pronounced. Some kind of freaking French. You want to speak French? Speak it to each other. Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. Yes, she did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. Did I like the Fantastic Beast that. trilogy? Now I thought they only did two movies. The three three. Oh, that's right. I didn't see the third one. No, I didn't. No. I like the first one. The third one is no Johnny Depp, and they got mad. And honestly, it should have been Mads Mikkelsen from the beginning. Yes, it should have. I like, would have enjoyed I, it better. You know me. I love Johnny Depp. I really do. I think he's a hell of a guy, and I think he's a good actor. The moment I, you know what I think he needs? I think he needs help. I think he needs help. I, I don't think he has like real friends in his life right now. And that's really sad. But no, I don't like those movies very much. Yeah, like I, I appreciate the attempt the moment i saw johnny depp's name in the credits rolling you knew he was the villain one, i knew it was him. yeah yeah it's kind of like darth revan you just knew from the beginning which totally sucks because that's the whole entire reason i wanted you to play that game yeah it's i, I, I see it from the beginning dumb. and it's like i just knew dumb. it right out the Fuck game you guys was... for spoiling your own shit yeah that's why who's the acolyte it's star wars acolyte i don't know i've seen the trailers i don't know who the acolyte is I don't care. I hope it's Plagueis. I do. I want. I want a live action Darth Plagueis, but but he's still a Padawan, or like a you know an apprentice. And then he, we get to see him kill his master. And then we get to see him take on Sheev Palpatine at the very end. Right? He meets Sheev. I've seen another trailer. Is it him? The acolyte is a female. Okay. Oh no, a woman Sith? That's never been done before. Oh wait. That's what I'm actually uh, liking for it. The Acolyte isn't one we already know. 
It's a good. I'd class. rather it not. Like, here's the thing: if you're gonna have it, somebody I already know, make it Darth Plagueis. If it's gonna be someone I don't know, even better. I want a whole story not That's connected new. to the star, the Skywalker saga. If you can make a whole story not connected in any way to the Skywalkers, to Mando, to Boba Fett, to Ahsoka, to any of the other characters, its own fucking thing, I will shit a brick and jizz a snake. Just a full-on boa constrictor out my dick hole. <laughs> Ouch! Like in Harry Potter, when he makes that snake, when, <laughs> when he makes that snake appear, and Harry's like, ah, ah, ah. "By the way, if you're new to the channel, you got to be really fucking confused." This is what we do. Sometimes we just stop playing, and we rant about something, and then we continue. Oh, we'll rant about things that are off-topic from the game we're actually playing a lot too. Oh yeah, no. Oh hell yeah. I mean, like, I love Harry Potter, but Star Wars is my first love. Yeah. Well, no, that's not true. Batman's my first love. I, there's a picture of me as a little boy. I'm in a cowboy hat with a little pop gun, and I'm poking myself out of a Batman tent in the living room, like one of those little tiny little tents you can put up for kids. Yeah, I, I mean, I remember Kevin Conroy and Mark Hamill's voice. I remember Mark Hamill's voice as the Joker before Luke Skywalker. Blew my mind! When I finally figured it out, I'm like, wait, my favorite hero is the guy who made me hide behind the couch as a kid? You see... What the... <laughs> R.I.P. Kevin. My three... Also, my, his name was Kevin. That is not a name for a man with a voice like that. My three, my three growing up was Transformers, X-Men, and the Batman. X Men was really good until it wasn't. Yeah. That theme song, though, that has slapped in our heads for, for 30 years. fucking years. Oh, damn it. Dude, it's like the first time I heard the uh, Harry Potter theme. It was the first trailer. Actually, it wasn't even a trailer, it was a commercial for the Coca Cola promotional thing they had going on <laughs> for the first movie and I heard the na, 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 and, it's, it and I'm like oh that is exactly what it should sound like that is exactly <coughs> what it's, who the kicks. fuck and then you realize it's the same guy who did Star Wars and all the other shit and you're like yep yep that tracks that fucking tracks it yep. tracks it kicks oh it was so good it slapped too hard oh <sighs> She trusts me. She trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. <laughs> well, if Sharona trusts you, very well, I may know of something that could help us both. <coughs> By the way, this game is also good. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin. It's a shame I have 600 games to play. And there's only one of me. And I have to edit videos. And I had oh, we got to get one more playthrough on the, uh... On what? The PS1. Uh, mm. Was that Star Wars or was that the Harry Potter you wanted to get another oh, episode in? both of those. Because you wanted to hook up the 360 and I was going to bring I need to just get. Games. I just need to get a whole shelving system and everything right there on the wall so I can I could put everything mom might be able to help me get that installed and everything now cause she was like I want your stove clean and to be fair my stove did look like a fucking mess for a while but now it's clean yay cause I got the air fryer by the way air fryers oh my god oh my I'm never gonna use a stove again I just need a way to boil pasta properly and I'm set Rice cooker. I Maybe. believe it can do that. Maybe. I don't know. I've not used a rice cooker to boil a like, I got the yet. parchment things for the, the, the air fryer. That shit holds grease and butter without dripping. That's good. That's good. Right? I'm like, okay, this is witchcraft. This is fucking witchcraft. Uh, air fryers? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's amazing. I First time I used it. I, I, I mean, I just had some chimichangas that I cooked up in there. It takes like 20 minutes. They come out piping hot and crispy. Put some hot sauce on it. Oh, I have a gay old time. 
have a gay old time with that beef in my mouth. Uh, mm. Okay. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not... Hey, boys like rice cooker, air fryer, panini press, set for life. <laughs> Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. You got long fingers. Tell me, do you like to use those for other things? Uh, I'm talking about the sex. I got that. I got that need for a scratch along my ass. I've got an itch on my prostate. You think you can uh, give it a little scratchy scratch? <laughs> that long knobby finger of yours. See, what women like is the, the talons. As long as uh, you... I don't know what freaky bitches you've been with, but I always I've always been told to clip my nails. Y'all don't know this, but D has like literal claws. Like, see, I'm not even kidding. He's had these since I've known him. See, my girls like the claws except on this finger. Uh, uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> and you, everyone knows which finger and they know why. Yeah, you're like a you're like a backwards guitarist. Uh, Hamboy also says a crock pot. That's actually a good idea too. I've got one of those. Yeah. They're good. D yeah, he knows how to make a mean pot of chili. considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Yeah, I remember from the books. Can't see things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. I think I could work along that. I buy a thing off them, and it's mine until I die, then it goes back to the goblin family. Alright. It seems like it's only a downside for whoever wants it, like my kid or whatever, you know? And uh, honestly, they can go fuck themselves and make something of themselves like I did. It makes sense for a pact with goblins. Yeah, sure, it why is, not? I am making this. You are giving me something in exchange for it. It is a loan. When the time comes, I will take it back. I will slaughter many enemies with it. And when I'm dead and gone, it is yours again. Yeah, sure. I, I mean, I don't... like. That's their way. Let their way be their way, man. I, I That's the thing. I'm just... I'm easy like that. You know? I just... I'm very non-confrontational like that. Like, yeah, man, sure, why not? Are those dudes on the map enemies? Yeah, uh, the little red dots. Oh, that's right, you can't see them, but towards the bottom? Yeah. But I think they were, like, probably just spiders or low levels. We're just chilling, vibing, walking. This game is a vibe. I like it. Oh, my God, the little kid in me. <laughs> Oh, man. One of these days, I gotta just spend, like... Once I get, like, next month all set out and everything, I'm just gonna, like, spend a day just vibing in this game. With the headphones on, smoking weed, and doing literally nothing else. Because I need it. Just like I need to do this. Ah. Safety. <coughs> They'll be with you in a moment. <laughs> ah, and there it is. The witch is too. How's that pain in your chest? You all right? It's not as bad as yesterday. It's the same. It's the same. Oh. Uh, I say tomorrow. Go to the doctor. See what's up. Yeah, I'm going to the doctor tomorrow morning. Yeah, I'm glad you were able to make it today, though. Yeah, it didn't get worse. Which is why I came, was able to come over today. Yeah. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now You're a goblin. You guys have crazy cool magic. Actually, if anything, that fart is with me now. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Woo! Load it! No, that, opening the door ain't gonna do anything. You have to turn on the fan, and that'll corrupt the audio, so. <sighs> what about this helmet makes it so special? The helmet of Urtgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged during a time of unity among the goblin clans. It inspired greatness, that is, until it was no longer ours. Then it became something else. 
a symbol of what has been lost, of all that wizard kind has taken from us. Those Pretending bastards. would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me. Should My bike's still out there. Yes. Good. I like living in a safe neighborhood. It seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Dark-hearted? <laughs> I like that phrase. So. Yeah. That, I that is a good term, phrase. Could be waiting for me inside the tomb. Considering a dark Most politicians are dark-hearted. My heart is so dark, let me tell you what, okay, there's no heart dark in my let me tell you what, Jack. I've got a, I've got one of the darkest hearts out there. I can't do a good bite. <coughs> I could do a great Trump though. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Hogwarts Legacy. So nice. We're like thirty minutes into the video. If you're offended by this, go fuck yourself. Can you do a Jack Nicholson? It sounds too, like, you know, it's like, well, Sparky, here's the deal, all right? You want to get with the lady, you got to be a straight shooter. Do you got it? You know, no, no, you got to do an earlier jack than that. Yeah, right. No, that's the hard part. The early stuff is it's the later one that's easier to do. I know, but yeah. when I think of doing a Jack Nicholson, I think of early, early, like 70s Jack. Yeah, that's so early, right? I know. Yeah. That's no. why it's harder to do. It really is. Yeah. But it's some of this iconic, the shining Jack. <laughs> no work, all work and no play makes Trump a dull boy. So dull! <laughs> so dull. People say it's the dullest of all. I gotta play, gotta play. And people say it's all work, it's not all work, gotta play. Gotta grab him by the pussy, you know what I'm saying? Gotta grab him right by the pussy. <laughs> you gotta grab him right by the pussy, you know? <laughs> you can do that when you're when you're famous, when you're black. When you're hot and black, you can do that. No, I love the, 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 the tuna queen thing. I am the uh, tuna queen. Yeah, you would think it would be Michelle, but uh, she is not the tuna queen. She couldn't make a tuna casserole, let alone uh, be the tuna queen. Uh, uh, that was that Cards bit. Against Humanity we were playing, and I don't that remember what combo, funny. but I had to do like a, an Obama impersonation. Like, I am the tuna queen. See me sit on my throne of tuna. And uh, uh, we were fucking dying, man. That bit was funny. Uh, dude. That's so oh, good. cards against humanity, man. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I love fruit. I love fruit. We're gonna do it. I would love to make an RPG that really takes your intelligence into consideration. <coughs> like, we have low intelligence in Fallout, but it doesn't really take it into consideration in conversation. And I wish it would, because it does in the first and second fallout. If you have a low intelligence, your character is just like, ah! in every conversation, just like, no, no, no. And I, I really need that in a video game, where your the voice actor themselves has to go. Ah! be really funny just be the dumbest person in the wasteland or everything that comes out of your mouth is just like a Joe Rogan quote sealed <laughs> cause he's an idiot and now I really kicked the hornet's nest people love Joe Rogan for some reason I don't get it you guys a fucking douchebag curious light them on fire no that's not what we do here. We need not that. What we need is the light. In fuego? Yeah, no, Lumos. just Lumos. Oh, I get it. Let me bring the mouth over here. Knox. He doesn't say the thing. I wish they kept the spells consistent like that. Okay. Yeah, I. 
<laughs> yeah, as soon as you picked it up, I understood what the point was at that. It was like, okay, you just drag and drop. Basically, yeah. All right, Link. Chill out. Breaking pots everywhere. Yeah, it's still getting you. Yeah, I need to stop laughing. <laughs> Good luck. I'm I know, here. I know. Especially when we get to Alan Wake in a little bit here. Oh, uh, yeah. No, that's we're gonna, both too funny. That's, that's going to hurt. As, as long as I don't have to go to the hospital later. This can't be the witch's tomb. It's so not, why are you here? Different. Well, my side was hurting, and I decided to go hang out with my buddy and laugh my ass off. Yeah. Oh. Oh, uh, yeah, a bunch of... Ah, uh, I see. Now you gotta bombard that door open. Good for you. Uh, let's see. Hold on. How do I... Oh, that's right. Right, 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 right. Expelliarmus, Incendium. Do I have Bombarda? Depulso would be the one to use, I would think. Uh, yep. Oh, right. Bombarda is a new... A new high-level spell that you'll get later... Or whatever. Maybe. Who knows? I just remember only like two characters in the series use Bombardo and they blow everything the fuck up. I with think it. Hermione is one of them. Hermione and Lil. Uh, um, uh, Ginny. Mm. Ginny uses it to destroy everything. <laughs> yeah. That ginger queen. She was supposed to look more like Jean Grey than. Like, don't get me wrong, Bonnie's cute, but they could have, like... Like, Hermione was not supposed to be prettier than Ginny. No. Like, that's just that's just the thing. I feel like they could have... Like, I've seen Bonnie with, like, you know, a good bit of makeup and whatnot. She's very beautiful, but they left her rather plain. Which, I mean, there's nothing wrong with your natural look. <coughs> I'm just saying, I'm talking about proper adaptation. <coughs> and I don't want to be offensive to a, a woman who is... By all means, a good person, you know. Oh, I've like, got. I found this image of Bonnie. She's in um, uh, bondage gear. She is so hot. Mm -hmm. She is just oh uh. yeah. But at the same time, yeah, to uh, have Bonnie's as Ginny versus um, Emma Watson. Emma Watson. Wow, brain. I think I'm Emma too, Watson. I'm too, is a, it, Emma Watson this. is a beauty. I'll give her as that. Hermione. Like is, I can see on a physical scale why they cast her as Belle. On a talent wise, no, they should have like dubbed over her voice. If anything, I could have done it for her. For, you know, <laughs> oh, isn't this amazing? But based on the description of the characters in the book, no, that she's too. Even even J.K. Rowling when meeting her went, oh, she's way too pretty and too white. Because <clears throat> apparently Hermione's supposed to be black as well, or at least olive complexion. Well, honestly, with the gap between the te the teeth and having two big front teeth, I've seen a lot of African Americans with that going on. That's not out of the norm. I don't get it. My mom had a gap in her teeth, I and then she got her teeth fixed. I got a gap in my teeth. You. Let's not talk about your teeth. You should see. <laughs> Dude's got a shark's mouth. It's fucking wild. He had a jaw problem that never got set properly. Because doctors are dicks. Uh oh. Speaking of dicks. Oh shit. Cut off. What? Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Yep. Let me take a couple hits. Let me adjust myself. Because we've been just kind of bullshitting for the past 40 minutes. <laughs> oh yeah, we were talking about this exact <laughs> bullshit the, the last time we were talking about Harry Potter stuff. <laughs> oh, well, uh, how Harry and you the Amphira... You set Josepra on them instead of just lighting them on fire. He could have just cut off their heads. Would that have worked? I... Yeah, we still don't know. Yeah, handboy. I want adventure in that great white <laughs> somewhere. Just put me in the dress. Me, like, have Gaston hitting on me and being like, no, I don't know. You could have put... 
You know, everyone else. That's the thing about that movie. If she was either dubbed or played by somebody else, that movie would have been a banger. Because Gaston was awesome. Lafou. Have you seen that one? Yeah, we watched it together. Yeah, we watched the whole thing together. Everyone it, else is great, even because we had that conversation where I was like, "Wait, isn't Gaston gay?" And it, it, that moment was it, you said Lafou was gay, and I'm like, and then it came back. Wait, the actor who played Gaston in in real life, he's gay, and that's where I was. That, confused. And that's what makes it so fucking. And that's is, where I was confused. He is peak performance. Oh, he is a. Excellent oh actor. my I love it. God, everyone in that, even even the side characters, except all the for Emma Watson, everything in that movie is awesome. They auto tune her, and I love Emma Watson. Honestly, if they didn't auto tune her and just let her use her natural voice, I think it would have been better because it's like, yeah, she's just really pretty. Let her have a like. Let her have like a Tina voice from Bob's Burger. Like, oh, isn't this amazing? <laughs> so everybody just likes her because she's so fucking hot. And then Beast uh, likes her because she's smart. But then she's like, well, I'm also a good singer. And everyone's like, no, no, <laughs> no. That Gaston song is so goddamn good in live action. Oh, yeah, the live action version really. Oh, and Beast songs, um, Evermore. E Beast song was one song, Evermore, that they had. Because Beast didn't really get a song, you know? Like, yeah. No, I, I really think that movie had potential over Beast all the Beast didn't get a song. His people got a song about him. Like, listen, if I ever met, if I ever got famous, got into Hollywood, met Emma Watson, I'd date her, marry her, and have kids with her. But I'd be like, honey, you can't sing. <laughs> If I ever got famous, went to Hollywood, I would find Johnny Depp, marry him. <laughs> Yay! Can I be the best man? I don't know. You'd have to ask Johnny Depp. He might have a better best man. No, on there's his no side. better best man than me. Yeah. Could you imagine my best man speech? I'm amazing. Fuck everyone else. It's time to live in positivity of yourself, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Well All right, motherfuckers. Hold on a second. There we go. Oh shit, they're they're rather high levels. Alright, I ow. I'm just trying to remember how to actually do combat. Okay, at least those barrels explode. They're not staying back. Okay, at least they take damage from every other blast spell too. But you're just using in fuego. There we go, we can one. Whoa. We're okay. Alright. Actually, I wanted to check on something in our inventory real quick. Gear. Ooh, did you pop that wrist? Yep. Hmm. What is it? It's either the 17th or the 21st, whichever one's the Monday. I'm going to get new x-rays done on it in the oh weeks. on your on your yeah and then they'll schedule the surgery after that oh I guess that mask isn't unlockable okay there's like a lot of cool shit that unlocks after a while yeah it is what do I got here open the wings and turn I think oh here we go wait now yeah. Lumos. Mm. If I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. You could be rotated. Power it up somehow? Ooh. 
looks like there was a thing on your left up above. Yeah, oh. up there. Uh, like that's supposed to levitate what you're standing on or something. I. This has a moth imprinted on it. <gasps> Same as the door. Oh, uh, I get it now. Take it out of the door, put it on the thing. There we go. I think it needs both. <sighs> no. What oh. the f Is this supposed to... Lumos. And then... Oh, the pulso. Oh, okay. Alright. That's annoying as shit, but alright. It's annoying as shit, but I'll allow it. Puzzles. Because it had to be puzzles. I hate puzzles, Eddie. I love chickens, Eddie. Everybody rock your body right. Rude dudes play all night. Not really. That'd be cool, but this motherfucker has to cook for his brothers because they're kind of stupid. They don't know how to cook for themselves. It's really sad. Uh, the one, it's not so much that he doesn't know how as he just doesn't have the ability to stand there and cook. Oh, uh, yeah, well, he survived cancer. We give him a break on most things. Yeah. The other one is an idiot. <laughs> Sometimes. Yeah, most of the time. Uh, neither of them can cook chicken, though. That is such an easy thing to cook. Put it on a medium heat, put some oil in it, let the fucker cook for like, you know, Not I'd say like seven to ten minutes on each side while rotating it around. So about 20 minutes of just rotating it and letting it cook. Cut it open a little bit. Look, is it pink? Is it pink? Is if it's not pink, if it's still juicy, boom, you're ready. I, neither of my brothers know how to cook chicken. Okay, so next time Mark gives me the business, I'll be like, at least I know how to cook chicken. It, when and it take off my glasses and just look him dead it, in the eyes. When it comes to cooking chicken, I'm the one who has to cook it. Listen, um, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not the smartest man in the room. I try to be sometimes, but you know, I I know my limitations. But chicken is easy. It's almost as easy as your mom. But ah! at the same time, a rat has tried to show me how to cook pot stickers four or five times, and I still can't cook pot stickers. What are you retarded? Sometimes. <laughs> Every time he shows me... How do we get monetized? Every time he shows me how to cook pot stickers, I end up, when I cook them myself, I end up burning them. I don't know why. I just can't cook them. And they cook in five fucking Guys, minutes. my friends are idiots. <laughs> I, I, I don't... Ow, 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 ow. See? I don't know why. I, it's just one of those things I just can't do. I'm such a good cook. The best thing is, I know what works together. Oops. But then for the, uh, for the good points, I am... I am the guy who can fix Thanksgiving dinner in an afternoon by myself. 
That is also fair. You did make a very good Thanksgiving and Christmas dinner. And it's no matter what you want cooked, I know how to do it. Most Except of the for time. Pot stickers. It well, you don't do pot stickers for Thanksgiving. It can't if you're not a pussy. <laughs> What is through here? What are we missing here? Yeah, I think that pulls out. We're missing something here. That looks like it comes out of the wall. Something's supposed to happen here, but I don't know what... Oh! Okay. okay. No, not that, you fucking idiot. Or that, whatever. No other way. Um... Crack those knuckles, crack that back, get into it and lick a sack. Wait, what? <laughs> I, I love, I love the, I love the uh, ninja sex party. If we were gay, song. <laughs> well, Brian blows a dude. What? <laughs> Here's a list of things Brian likes to suck. Dick, 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 wish I had the talent of that fucking guy. Of Danny like, oh my god, dude. He is so talented. I like to think about, cause like they call themselves the Game Grumps but neither of them are necessarily grumpy. Like, granted Aaron is a little more grumpy than Dan. That's why it's, hey, I'm grump and I'm not so grump and not so grump is said by Dan. Like, we're the rude dudes but it's not like we're like edgy, sexist, racist, homophobes or anything. We're just... We'll say fuck at the drop of a hat and if we don't get monetized because that... vulgar as fuck. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna go through and bleep everything. I'm not gonna sit for two hours listening to a thing, putting in clips. Yeah, said. no. Y'all like, think it's, like, easy as fuck to do. You're wrong. You're I, so wrong I want to hurt you physically while you sleep. I just want you to wake up to me hovering above you choking your ass out. You wrong ass motherfucker. You see, it, 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 it's like that. He's rude as fuck, and I'm just. I don't care. I'm an agent of chaos. As long as <sighs> chaos. Is, man, I'm an agent of chaos. As long as chaos is happening. Jump, you little cunt. <laughs> Right into the water uh, like it. Uh, 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 you fell edge. five fucking feet into water. What's yeah. with that? Oh. 20 feet, but yeah, still. It's 20 feet into water. I can do that and it would hurt more because I weigh like twice him. I, uh, uh, I weigh twice what he wears with clothes on. All right. Uh, I have this problem where I can't go anywhere I can't see. Uh oh. And that right there is why. Oh, that wasn't explosive. That was just slamming into his head. <laughs> oh, fuck. Flame on. Flame on, bitch. Oh, you exploded. The power of Christ compels you. No, it doesn't. Not you, them. There it is. Now where's the big guy in armor? What do you think this is? Elden Ring? Ow. Actually, creating a Harry Potter-like character in Elden Ring would be kind of sick. Starting to think they're a, a continuous spawn. Huh? Starting to think they're a continuous spawn. They're not. Oh, 
I remember this part, they're not. Okay. Hell yeah. No, right, this is cool. a puzzle area. See the butterflies? Alright. Yeah. yeah, they were just they just kept coming, so I thought it was a continuous <laughs> spawn. And it was two spawns. Lumos. Lumos bitch. Get your bloody ass. <laughs> Lumos. Huh. Lumos. I don't know. Come here, you. Something has to move to it. There you go. Yeah, there it is. No one plays like Harlan, talks mad shit like Harlan. No one edits videos in a timely manner like Harlan. I see YouTubers bitching about burnout. That's cause they suck dick on like Harlan. Black so. fingerless gloves. Ah, oh, edgy. Awesome. Oh, let's get edgy in this bit. Ooh, box. Ooh. Hold on a second. Wait. Oh, did that just go? Oh. Yeah, no. God damn it. You slow bitch. You. You bitch. Lumos. There's a treasure chest on that side. I saw. Let me open. Oh. To raise that platform. That must be it. I I know how it works, kid. I just yeah. Where did the butterfly go? Uh, the other butterfly is over there being held. But the real question is see the problem. Yeah. So, here's the thing. You gotta get it to go up and capture it and get it in the door. Right. But this oh. doesn't work without that. I see. And I don't... You gotta get it all the way to the top while you're not on it. Grab the butterfly then jump up and while it's going down. Lumos. Ooh, that's annoying. Hold on. Remap. This puzzle sucks. Dude, welcome to the concept of puzzles in video games. This puzzle sucks like fucking Resident Evil puzzles. There's no way to do that. You don't have a freeze time spell? No, not. No. Oh, I'm thinking of the wrong game for that. I need to bring moths to the door. I will fucking delete this game forever if you can stop the bad boy. Lumos. That just brings along the same fucking problem. <laughs> I have one idea.
No. He drops it the moment he... The moment you jump up back, then it goes back to the thing. All right, there goes what I was saying. Lumos. All right, there goes what I was saying for it then. Wait, you can only have one butterfly at a time. Yep. <sighs> yeah, I know. I really don't know <clears throat> myself. I don't remember... How long have we gone into this? Been about an hour. Alright. Uh, Wait, hold on. I don't know. Want to try to figure out this puzzle? Yeah. No, I don't want to be invisible, you fucking dumbass! Oh. Ah! I, I genuinely don't get how this is supposed to work. Fuck you. This game has way too many fucking button combos. It pisses me off. It's like, is there something down here? No? Okay. I don't... I... I you got the one butterfly from down there. I got both of them in the door besides that one, and I don't know how to get that one in the door. These are for alteration. No. I don't know, man. Fuck you, dude! Climb it! Can we just save right here? Because. Yeah, I'm. Kind of over it. Yeah, yeah, I. Like, yeah, good, great, cool. Because, yeah. <laughs>